Assalamu alaikum friends welcome back to my channel hope so you all are fine today we will find the value of x from this equation which is x raised to the power 6 is equal to 244,140,625 it's a bigger number it has a nine digit number here so how can we find x is an integer so if we can see here, it is a number, it is the larger number, which has a last digit is 5. If x raised to the power 6 has a number which has last digit is 5, so my question is, what do you know about it? That last digit is 5. Last digit is 5. We can get the last digit of x as 5 as well because if any number has a digit 5, it means the value of x will also be a last digit is 5. Most of you ask me why because if an integer has its ending 5, that means its last digit is 5. For example, if we have any number which has last digit 5, raised to the power n will give us any number which has last digit 5. For example, 5 raised to the power 2 is equal to 25, its last digit is 5. 5 raised to the power 3 is equal to 125, its last digit is 5. Similarly, if we check other terms, 5 raised to the power 4, 5 raised to the power 5, they give us any number which has last digit is 5. So it's mean last digit of x will be 5. Now this x cannot be a 3 digit number. It can only be a 2 digit number. But there are 9 digit here. Here we have a 9 digit number. Okay. Now analyze for 10 raised to the power 6. 10 raised to the power 6 is same as 6 times zeros here. So it has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 digits. How many digits? 10 raised to the power 6 has 7 digits. But here we have x raised to the power 6 have 9 digits. So if we compare both, so it will less than x raised to the power 6. Now, we will check for 20 raised to the power 6. It's mean 20 raised to the power 6 is same as 2 raised to the power 6 multiplied by 10 raised to the power 6 which is equal to 2 raised to the power 6 is same as 64 and it is same as 6 times zeros. So it has 8 digits now. How many digits it has? eight digits so if we again compare it with given equation so it has nine digit number so it's mean it is also less than x raised to the power six okay now we'll check for 30 raised to the power six which is same as three raised to the power six multiply by 10 raised to the power six so three raised to the power six is 729 multiply by 6 times zeros here now it is a nine digit number six digits from here and 729 into 1 is 729 so three digits from here so it has nine digits so 729 million is greater than this x raised to the power 6 so it's mean here we have 244 million 140,625 so it's mean that x raised to the power 6 will also be less than 245 multiplied by 10 raised to the power 6 okay so it's mean that are this number which is a nine digit number lies between 
this 20 raised to the power 6 and 30 raised to the power 6. So, 20 raised to the power 6 is less than x raised to the power 6. And x raised to the power 6 is less than 30 raised to the power 6. Now, from here, if we take its absolute value, so it will be 20 less than absolute value of x less than 30. Absolute value of x is also an integer. So, as we already told that, last digit of x must be 5. So, of course, between 20 and 30, the last digit 25 has a last digit 5. So, the value of x from here is plus minus 25. So, so the value of x is plus 25 and minus 25. Hope so you will like my video. If you like my video, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.